Hello, welcome to CC Imaging's unboxing video for the Bosto 22 HDX. My name's Ben, over there is Chris. Hello there. And we're just going to be looking at this today as we unravel it. It's just arrived fresh this morning and we want to take you through the process. We can see the box itself looks really nice, comes with a handy carry case there so it's easy to transport. Is that a presentation case? Is that I what they're called? it is. Oh, lovely. Certainly doesn't look like a shipping case to me. No, it looks good. So we're going to slice that open there, undo the little tabs, and uh, we should be in. in See a the second. goodness inside. It's very slow. I know. It takes his time. Come on. Can we pick up the pace a bit? Right, lay it down there. And there we are. So, as you can see, it's nicely tightly packed. We've got springy, ooh, lovely so and springy have. little bits of foam there, the end caps that cover the actual uh, thing. What's, the, what's that? It's a stand that fits on the back of it, and we have a box of DVDs as well. Ah, yes. And here we have the power cable, or Push at least part of the power cable. There we've got one end, and a three-pin plug looks like a Chinese end there, so that won't work. Ah. There we go. Yeah. Nice UK adapter there for you. It's, all, it's, it's nice of them to pop that in. It's very, very useful. Considering we're in the UK. Let's ease this out now. And the stand will just take that out of the sunken sections just there we can see. I guess he's going to look at that one first, Ben. I think he might do. Slice that open. Ah. Ooh. 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 Oh, there it Lovely. is. Lovely little stand there. It's a ratcheted stand that allows you to change the inclination of the tablet. All right, so if you're going to be going from, say, just viewing stuff to in a tablet mode. That's right, you can have it at 45 degrees or steeper or nice and flat at your desk. Oh, that's good. You will have to be careful of any lights above you, though, because it is a high-gloss screen. All right, OK. Nice and thick bit of an end cap there. Lovely. Pop that over there. Take that out. Nice. Incidentally, that one's uh, very similar to the other side, but houses a sneaky little power cable uh -huh. there. So you can plug that into the other end of that, as you can see. The tablet's packaged in a plastic sleeve just to uh, stop the housing getting any marks during transit. Pop that down, lift this up. The Bosto 22 HDX is actually 21 and a half inches across and it has two banks of 10 express keys per side. And a little, 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 a little nub in there. Fantastic. A little rollers on the side. You get a piece of software to program those express keys with any keyboard shortcut you desire. Very useful for Photoshop. Handy stuff, which is how we're going to be looking at this, basically, because we are image editors and retouchers, so we're looking at this from a slightly different view to um, other reviews we've like seen. Digital Illustrators, for example. Exactly. So we're looking at it from a, a more of a photo editing point of view, using Photoshop and Illustrator and stuff like that. So. So we can see some vertical marks on the front. Don't worry, that's just a screen protector to stop the screen actually getting any marks during transit. And looking at the side there, we have a power key, the silver one. Then we have the menu and various other buttons to change modes and colour and contrast. And on the left edge, as you look at it, we have all of the different ports. There we have the power port, HDMI, DVI, VGA, and USB. Four screws there for the bracket. It can also consequently be visa mounted if you have an Ergotron arm or a similar arm. The ratcheted bracket itself does go quite flat and with all the ports being on the side, the tablet's unencumbered. Unencumbered? If you want to use it flat against the <laughs> desk, which is very good. <laughs> And the DVDs, oh, Les the, DVDs. The little uh, little prizes there. Just open that. Ooh, what do we have here? 
Aha! Uh, ha. I know what this is. Toothbrush. Yep. The, the suspense is killing me. <laughs> ah, so this is the little uh, pen that comes with it. The stylus, one might call it. That's right. It's quite chunky. I quite like it because it does feel really nice in your hand. You can flip it round and it will automatically change between the eraser tool and, say, a pen tool within Photoshop, which is dead useful. Over 2,000 levels of pressure for both the pencil end and the eraser end. So you can go from really nice and thin and light to a uh, thick... Thick and chunky. Yeah. For meaningful strokes. For making sure you colour within the lines. That's right. So just catching up here, we've also got a HDMI cable there, a screwdriver, a driver disc and a screen cloth. The screwdriver not to be used on the screen, obviously. No, no. Definitely stick to the pen. I've got to love a smudge guard. <laughs> <laughs> A half glove that prevents you creating smudges on the screen as you work. It's also to be noted, it's very stylish as well. A USB cable we have... ...various spare nibs and a nib extractor so that we can replace the nibs, which will wear eventually. They are designed to be softer than the screen itself, so they don't scratch it. And we also have a HDMI to VGA adapter. Useful or is that stuff. a HDMI to DVI adapter? One of the two. There we have it. Al Jolson has uh, finished his demo <laughs> and now caresses the screen. <laughs> Right. Well, thank you very much for watching. Uh, that has been our unboxing uh, whilst uh, he over there takes all of his paperwork with him and sods off. Uh, we will be back next time with a full review of the screen in, uh, in the usage of Photoshop, which is pretty good. So if you want to get in touch with us, it's 0113 -234 -8329. You can get us on email, which is orders at ccimaging.co.uk. And of course, the website is www.ccimaging.co.uk. Ta ta for now. Bye bye, everybody.